Sauna lovers, my name is Katie DeChico and today we'll be talking about far infrared sauna health benefits documented by both the scientific and medical community. For the last 50 years, far infrared sauna has silently taken hold in the American detoxification marketplace. In the last decade, the far infrared sauna industry has exploded not only due to the numerous documented studies of improved health, but because the word has gotten out. Far infrared works. Well, what exactly does it work for? Our customers can't help but brag to their friends and their fi that their fibromyalgia pain is either greatly reduced or non-existent. That chronic back pain is more controlled than ever before. We've had clients say that their far infrared sauna use contributed to reduce blood pressure, enough for their physician to take them off their blood pressure medication. Everyone sleeps better and your skin becomes so soft to to sweat debris and clogged pores and far infrared encouraging elastin and collagen production. There are more health benefits and treatable conditions than can be covered in one article, let alone one book. Today's doctors around the country are using far infrared sauna more and more to treat chronic conditions like diabetes, cardiovascular disease, Lyme parasite, obesity, and some cancers. Detoxification is at the heart of far infrared healing. The human body produces far infrared light in the form of body heat at exactly 9.4 microns. These are called biophotons. Biophotons bio are the energy that your cells use to communicate and carry out all cell cellular processes. When we apply 9.4 microns of far infrared light to the human body, it charges each cell with which in turn vibrates the cell next to it. This vibration effect occurs up to four inches deep, and as each cell is fully charged, it has all the energy needed to bring itself to a level of homeostasis. And we will experience some of this in the form of sweat. An example of this cellular vibration can be experienced by placing your hands together with your palms flat like a prayer. You should immediately feel the skin be between your hands begin to, to warm up. If you keep your hands here long enough, they'll even sweat together. Uh, you'll notice that the air temperature around your hands has not changed, um, even though your palms are sweating. So that's kind of how that cell-to-cell -cell charge works, where your hands are charging the cells next to them, vibrating as your hands become fully charged and warmed up, then they're going to start sweating together. And it doesn't really matter what the air temperature uh, around your hands is. Um, The cell-to-cell -cell charging um, with the application of far infrared light continues to occur long after your sauna session ends. This doesn't mean that you will sweat all the time, or all that time, but your body will use the energy to effectively move toxins from the internal organs into the bloodstream to be processed by the liver, the kidney, the bowels, the kidneys, and bowels, or redeposited somewhere else in your body where it can be sweat out during another sauna session. Now you can read more about detoxification and multiple studies related to detoxification by clicking some of the links here in um, this article. So that's great. I'm shaking loose toxins and I'm sweating them out, but how's it going to relieve my back pain or my wife's fibromyalgia? We all we have all experienced the relief of heating of a heating pad on a sore muscle. So how is a far infrared sauna going to give me more relief than my heating pad? These are common questions and the answer is long. Here goes. When we stimulate the core temperature of the body to a low grade fever by applying far infrared light, the body says, I need to cool down. Our, body, our bodies are very efficient at eliminating heat to protect us. Our skin will use the air temperature around it to dissipate heat. Your respirations will increase to take in cooler air that will cool your blood and your heart rate will increase to help push the oxygen rich, nutrient rich and cooler blood throughout the body. This oxygen rich, nutrient rich blood will flow, flood your capillaries, muscles and internal organs, clearing away inflammation and toxins that can cause chronic pain. Although there is no known causes of fibromyalgia, sufferers feel the pain and the lethargy, and there is some indication that it's related um, to toxins, environmental toxins that your body can't metabolize, stuffs, in, stuffs it in um, someplace in the muscles, and then sure enough, you have generalized pain. You don't know what it's from. Um, so sweating it out is one of the best ways that you can um, eliminate and alleviate fibromyalgia pain. Um, we're really kind of working out the root cause of the pain rather than just treating symptoms. Um, there is a study listed here about fibromyalgia and myofascial pain syndrome 
a demo a dilemma um this was written by uh uh, Dr. Chandola and a Dr. Chakraborty, and they found that um, non-pharmacological hmm, therapies <laughs> for FMS and MPS, like way on or soothing warm therapy, um, employs far infrared dr uh, ray dry sauna bath um, at about 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, it use two to five cycles a week, um, uh, have significant effects on pain reduction. And you can read, uh, again, more information about fibromyalgia, um, uh, through links from this article. Medical studies show that far infrared sauna significantly reduces chronic back pain for improved quality of life. In a randomized double-blind placebo-controlled trial of 39 participants with chronic low back pain, was conducted to see if the effects of far infrared therapy would alleviate the pain. All subjects suffered from chronic low back pain for a minimum of six years, but initial pain levels differed. Half of the participants received the far infrared therapy and the control group received the placebo. Data was collected using an 11 point numerical rating scale at commencement and then at weekly intervals for, for seven variables for each subject. Overall pain, standing still, pain bending forward, pain bending backward, pain rotating right, pain rotating left, pain bending right, and pain bending left. Participants each scored their back pain from 1 to 10, 10 being the worst pain. The result, participants from the treatment group average pain levels of 6 to 10 fell to 3 to 10 at the end of the study. The placebo group fell from 7.4 of 10 to 6 of 10. So you can read more about pain relief um, also with links within this article. Uh, the FDA has approved the use of far infrared for treatment of heart disease. The body's method of cooling itself through increased respiration and heart rate leads to a passive cardiovascular workout. The passive cardiovascular workout your heart receives when cooling the body induces the production of high density lipoproteins, the good cholesterol in our body and in our blood that clears the low density lipoproteins or the bad cholesterol from our arterial walls. Um, high density lipoproteins are, are generally produced by the body when you exercise and this is the good cholesterol that literally eats the bad cholesterol off of your arterial walls, which is the low density lipoproteins. Um, there are a multitude of studies confirming the healing benefits of far infrared on the cardiovascular system. Heart health benefit, benefits include improved healing from car uh, from heart attack or myocardial infarction, management of congestive heart failure and COPD, management of chronic heart failure, improved blood pressure, improved endothel endothelial function, reduced heart rate, variability and oxidative stress, as well as enhanced physical performance. The authors of the study below have previously reported that repeated far infrared sauna Therapy improves the hemodynamics, peripheral vascular function, arrhythmias, and clinical symptoms in patients with chronic heart failure. The aim of this study was to investigate the effects of far infrared sauna therapy on the prognosis of CHF patients. Here's an excerpt from their study. Far infrared sauna therapy improves the prognosis of patients with chronic health, chronic heart failure. Uh, they say that we studied 129 page patients with CHF and in NYHA functional class 3 or 4 who were admitted to our hospital between January of 99 to March of 2001. In the Weyon therapy group, 64 patients were treated with far infrared ray dry sauna at 60 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes and then kept on bed rest with a blanket for 30 minutes. The patients were treated daily for five days during admission, and then at least twice a week after discharge. In the control group, 65 patients matched for age, gender, and NYHA functional, functional class were treated with traditional CHF therapy. The follow-up time was scheduled for five years. The results. Recent complete follow-up data on each patient were obtained. The overall sur survival rate was 84.5%. 12 patients died in the control group and 8 patients died in the way on therapy group at 60 months of follow-up. 
Cardiac events due to heart failure or cardiac death occurred 68.7% of the control group, but only 31.3% of the way on therapy group or far infrared sauna group um, at 60 months of follow up. In conclusion, way on therapy or far infrared sauna therapy reduced cardiac events in patients with congestive heart failure. This therapy is a promising non pharmacological treatment for congestive heart failure. Um, this was written by the Department of Cardiovascular Respiratory and Metabolic Medicine, um, the Graduate School of Med Medicine in Kagoshima University, um, Japan. And you can read again more about, uh, more about heart health um, by clicking on links within this article. The health benefits of far infrared sauna have been well researched and studied for more than 50 years. The results are in. Repeated far infrared sauna therapy improves the body's overall health and is a useful tool to combat risk factors such as cardiovascular disease and cancer. There are no contraindications for far infrared sauna use, but many customers have some of the following questions. I wanted to take a moment to address some of the most common ones. So, do far infrared saunas really work? According to the studies, medical professionals and our customers, there are many health benefits to far infrared sauna use that improves the overall quality of life for everyone. Do far infrared saunas cause cancer? Now, I completely understand why people think about this when they're researching saunas. In an infrared sauna industry, we're talking about warming the body from the inside out. Most people immediately think of a microwave. You are not going to cook in an infrared sauna. Um, because we're not using microwaves, um, we are using far infrared light waves tuned to the human body's own output of far infrared light in the form of body heat. We are literally manufacturing body heat in the saunas and charging your body with its own energy. To confuse things further, there are big scare tactics about EMF in an infrared sauna. Can the EMF of an infrared sauna cause cancer or other health problems? No, <laughs> absolutely not. Um, here's why. Everything in the universe emits EMF or electromagnetic field. Everything in the universe is bound by a positive and negative charge. Because everything in the universe falls on the EMF spectrum, we have identified bandwidths that have the ability to change DNA. This type of EMF is ionizing and is never, ever, ever, ever been found in in any infrared sauna in the history of infrared saunas. There are no dangerous EMFs in a far infrared sauna. And in case you didn't get that, there are no dangerous EMFs in a far infrared sauna. Um, I'll, I can put that into perspective slightly right here. Um, your light switches in your home are emitting 70 milligauss, just coming off of the light switch to about three feet, so 70 milligauss. Federal government regulates everything under 1,000 milligauss. Our saunas, our highest rated sauna in the home saunas is 10 milligauss, and two mil 10 milligauss at the heater and two milligauss at the bench. In the commercial saunas like this one, the heaters are re register at 1.6 milligauss of EMF at the heater and 0 0.3 milligauss um, at the bench. So if the federal government is regulating 1000 and your light switches are um, measuring at 70 from three feet and your home sauna is measuring 10 um, milligauss for two cent or for four centimeters, four centimeters, I have to check that. It'll be on the, it'll be on the article. <laughs> um, and then our ultra low EMF or our near zero medical grade saunas for people who are EMF sensitive, um, those saunas emit 1.6 milligauss at the heater and 0 0.3 milligauss at the bench um, once you move about 10 centimeters away, I believe. Um, again, those numbers will be on in the article. Um, so no one has ever died or become sick as a, as a result of far infrared sauna use. Um, Um, to put, oh wait, we already did this. Um, oh. 
How many calories do you burn in a far infrared sauna? You can burn up to 600 calories in a 30 minute infrared sauna session. Dr. Oz probably explain, explains it best in his video below, but the main reason you lose weight in a sauna isn't the act of burning calories by passively sweating, but ridding your body of inflammation caused by environmental toxins. Any obesity doctor will tell you it is not only the calories we take in, but the environmental toxins that get in the way of our metabolism, causing inflammation and weight gain. It shouldn't matter how many calories we take in. Our bodies are not designed to be overweight. We, we are not designed to gain weight. And so the only explanation really left is that environmental toxins that we're possibly allergic to, um, we're taking those in. It's causing inflammation. And the only way to get rid of it is to sweat it out. And then you'll notice the pounds drop off. Um, will my medical hardware and devices be affected by a far infrared sauna? No. This is a very common question and an important one. You know, you should always consult your physician if you do have um, pacers or anything like that. But we are producing body heat um, in these far infrared saunas. They are no more dangerous um, than holding hands. Many of our customers come to us for pain release, relief of a multitude of ailments. Um, but joint replacements or poorly healed broken bones can cause discomfort over time. Stretching these areas and getting blood flow into these areas can be difficult and painful. Uh, thankfully, a far infrared sauna will get the blood flowing and help you retain a stretch without causing harm or discomfort. Your hardware will not heat up any more than if you had a low grade fever of 100 degrees. Um, well, what if I have a pacemaker? The same rules apply. We are only manufacturing body heat and far infrared light does not have the ability to disrupt hardware like pacemakers or defibrillators and cannot heat them up. Are there any health risks in using a far infrared sauna? There are no known health risks associated with an infrared sauna outside of dehydration and heat exhaustion. Any individual with a chronic illness are under the age of 18 or over the age of 65 are pregnant or nursing should consult a physician prior to infrared sauna use. Um, another note I'm going to make there for pregnant women, um, as a mother myself, you don't want to detox while you're pregnant. All those toxins then get metabolized through your child. Um, wait until you're done breastfeeding, and then um, once you're done breastfeeding, then watch the pounds fall off. Um, that's all I can say about that. Um, I, I do not recommend um, that you use a far infrared sauna um, during pregnancy. Um, at least not for more than a few minutes to you know alleviate cramps or whatnot. But um, yeah, I, I don't recommend that you be pregnant and be in a sauna. So that's that. There you have it. That's um, everything that we could think of um, to kind of pare it down into a short little article um, to explain the health benefits that are well known now in the medical and scientific community. Thank you very much for wa watching and have a blessed day.